How the heck did you do that? It's such a great video. I can't handle it. Whoever's hearing this, you must watch this video. You must watch Art Me Express. What's up, guys? Welcome to Art Me Express, where we express with art. And today I'll be drawing my own fan made SCPs. And you can find more on my DeviantArt. Link in the description. And time to get to the video. So for all my characters, I don't have an SCP code or name or anything like that. So that's your job if you want to do it. So now time for this guy's abilities. So he, he or it, I would just call it he, um, can take the most powerful person in the room's power. Powerful and their most powerful ability, only their most powerful ability, and use it for himself. The downfall is he doesn't know how to use it as well as the person that already owns it. Another ability is his defense, which which is his nose, which is sharp, but he also smells things from miles away. But further testing needs to be done. But this can this means he can never be sneaked up on. His nose is also resistant of poisonous gases and things like that, and it stops it from flooding the lungs. Another two abilities are his metal hooves and poisonous tongue, which are pretty close in power. The poisonous tongue can lick opponents or objects and put and poison last for a long time. The opponent is weak, but if they are powerful, it, it is less time. And the metal hooves are strong. So, so, basi so basically with the poisonous tongue, if, if you're strong, yeah, it depends on what strength level you are. So yeah, um, the metal hooves are also good, but they're probably, they're most likely titanium, but they, but he can run pretty fast as well, which is pretty crazy. So they pack a punch. Um, this guy can also swallow, um, a, a humans and stuff like that. And also he's got the stare of death, which gives people depression, which is depressing. So this one is considered safe, and main goal is actually to protect humans, but it, it, is, it did not want to be taken into containment because it couldn't see humans. So the SCP facility actually allows it to go out of containment and wander around the facility freely, but when they tested keeping it in, the keeping it in containment, it just escaped and tentacle hugged everyone. The thing with this creature, it has a whole race, like, so it's around the world, for example, someone like Siren Head, but, but, but it's good. <laughs> there are different situations and things that happen when the SCP Foundation tried to take them in. For example, a couple of times there were cases of humans protecting the creatures, but they but in the end, they turn themselves in, protecting the humans like their girl. The SCP is closely related with SCP-999, and there have been tests of them, them in the same room, and they both seem very close, and the people observing even got extremely happy from the, from the somewhat chemical reaction of this much happiness in the same room. Further testing needs to be done on what they can achieve together, but there have there have been tests of them not together, and yeah, it's pretty crazy stuff. <laughs> but they're happy. Time for happiness. So this SCP is very similar to SCP one seven three or SCP Pe Peanut, as it, as in it's um it's created by an artist, most likely me in that world. And um, it, instead of um, if you don't look at it, instead of um, snapping your neck, it um eats your head, and it's just telling you to subscribe. So if you don't subscribe, it also eats your head. So yeah, better subscribe. You know what I heard about Amy? Amy likes spiders! Icky, wriggly, hairy, ugly spiders! I'm just, I'm just, I'm just kidding. Yeah, this one, I feel like this one's just self-explanatory. It's pretty, it's pretty weird. I made this one, um, on a day that I didn't have much time to draw, so, well, because I was doing a lot of other things. So yeah, I guess I just made this, and yeah. That's why I read that. I read that because, like, you know. Hey, me look spiders. 
So that's the end of the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see more SCPs or art from me, I post every day on my DeviantArt, and I just started posting on my Instagram. So go check them out. I hope you like the end result of the drawings. If you rather got entertained or scared, leave a like, share it with your friends, and make sure to express with art. It's me, a big fan of Art Me Express, and I think you should be one too. All you must do is hit the subscribe button and ring the bell to stay notified for new content. If you want to go that extra mile, you can follow his socials in the link in the description. I really like his webtoon comics. Now, if you don't want to do this, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Just kidding, I will devour your soul and you'll be sent to the fiery realm burning for a lifetime. <laughs> Thanks for watching this amazing video, and goodbye. Ooh -ooh.